This is a multi-part video series consisting of picture-in-picture -picture footage of Arma 3 gameplay from both the Game Master's perspective and the participants of the mission. As always, thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed the series as much as we enjoyed making it. If you like watching these episodes, maybe you'd like to join in too. Our team is looking for new members. Just click on the annotation on the screen or visit mgamers.com forward slash Arma Recruit. We'd love to have you join us. What's up guys, it's Funar from MultiplayerGamers.com. We're here with another Arma 3 Zeus mission, and we are aboard the Nimitz. In the terrain of Tanoa, so that we're on the newer of the Bohemia terrains. And today we have a good group of guys. As always, we have Conan58, we have Icarus, we have Luzon, we have Millers, and we have Rude. So if we look at our map, I've already pre-placed a couple of... Uh, points actually. This one is no longer correct. So I've replaced a couple of points. Um, as you can see, there are some ships here. They're LCM craft, which are the landing craft. And I've also placed a dot, a uh, exclamation point, on the bridge. So. What this means is the team is going to be on a rescue mission of sorts. Not really a rescue mission per se, though. Uh, but I am going to drop this because this is actually as a Charlie. So <clears throat> on this mission, the team is going to be supporting Charlie team, who has gotten themselves uh, into a bit of trouble. Basically, they were here as the storyline goes, they were up here at the loading docks, acquiring another set of cargo uh, from CSAT. And they were trans transporting the cargo by ground. And the idea is that they would meet up with their landing party at LZ Charlie. Well, it was a clandestine mission, and uh, basically they have gotten caught, and CSAT is hot on their trail. So, the team's objective is to support them. Well, for the purposes of this mission, Charlie has gotten up to this bridge. And we're going to go ahead and pre-place some vehicles on the bridge. And since these were CSAT uh, vehicles that they've stolen, we're going to place CSAT uh, vehicles. So, and then we'll put some, uh, we'll put Bravo team around it. So, in our situation here, we're going to go ahead and use... Um, we want, oops, we want a couple of the Typhoon trucks. And this being Arma, the game is not going to want me to put trucks on the bridge, so we have to persuade it into allowing that to happen. So there's one. And we'll grab a repair truck as well. And I'm going to do another ammo truck. And actually, we're going to do a device truck as well. So we have the ammo truck in front. We'll have the device truck in the middle. Have the repair truck after it, and then another ammo truck. Put him back here a little bit. Oops, still blow up. And we're not going to blow these up, but we are going to kill their fuel. I may actually end up moving these a little bit forward because I don't think they're far enough on the bridge. I want them kind of. Well, they're kind of in the middle. They could go a little further, but. So essentially, we're going to go ahead and put a bunch of CSAT troops out here as the force that is attempting to stop them from getting any further. 
So we're going to go ahead and drop a couple of these new inferents. Or not new inferents. We're going to drop an inferent. It's these guys I was talking about. And I'm just going to drop them a bit randomly. A couple down here on the water. <clears throat> and And then we're going to drop a bunch of troops. And since this is Tanoa, we're going to go ahead and use the Pacific ones. We'll do a support squad. And we'll give them sort of a... We'll do a diamond pattern. I'm going to put an air defense squad. Same type of thing, put them in a blob, kind of happy. UGB team. Put a couple dudes out in the boat. <clears throat> and I have to apologize this session. I have having an issue with some allergies or something or other, but uh, hopefully it won't affect my voice too much through this mission. So that's a fair collection of guys. Now probably wondering why the team stopped on the bridge. Well, we've been to this mission, or this uh, island before, and uh, we know that there are Black Order soldiers on this island, so we're going to go ahead and drop some Black Order troops as well. And I'm going to put them primarily in the town here, and the reason for that is I don't want the AI to be engaging each other just yet, because they will. They will start They'll start going after each other, and I'm not quite ready for that to happen. So we get a motorized team, get an HMG team, a couple of HMG teams, weapon squad, and so forth. And I'll I'll reinforce these guys. Yeah, that's what I was afraid of. I guess they were just a little bit too in range. <laughs> and then we're going to have to spawn uh, Charlie team as well. And we're going to use the Sokum guys for that. Which are... Actually, no, we're going to use the, uh, the uh, U.S. Marines. We're going to go ahead and let these guys fight. Maybe I won't let him fight yet. We have a little bit of time still. He is really still in range. There. No, you're not. Oh. 
I don't know where you're going, sir. <clears throat> All right, so we'll go from there, and we'll just see how that how that handles. So we have uh, CSAN on one side, Black Order on the other, and it'll be up to the team to uh, rescue uh, these guys. Now they have a couple of options they can do. They can either grab the convoy, take it themselves. Uh, they would have to refuel, of course. Um, or uh, they can choose to sling load these vehicles. Um, unfortunately, that will require a Chinook. So um, they'll be given that as an option. So man, I don't know what these guys are doing down here because they jumped. Proving once again the AI can be just dumb. Okay. And before I call this setup, it's very, very quick setup. Um, go ahead and make it so these guys don't disappear if they die. I too just jumped. with your buddies. So we're going to go from that, guys. So obviously, uh, the AI has their own mind again. Get you up there. So chances are, by the time the team actually starts this battle, it'll actually be raging already, <laughs> given what the AI wants to do here. Uh, but that's essentially the mission, guys. So they need to come here, defend Charlie, um, uh, which could be any form of a fight. And they're going to have to decide which side of the bridge they're going to want to go on. Um, or if they have another option, uh, there will be AA in the area though too, so just simply coming in and landing is not necessarily going to be the best option for them. So it'll be interesting to see what the team does in this scenario, it'll be interesting to see how the mission plays out. So basically bridge over troubled waters guys, you know, on to Noah. So this should be, uh, should be a fun mission, hope you enjoy the setup, hope you enjoy this mission, we'll see you on the next one guys.